ever since like 2005, most vehicles have this setup right here. The bearing is screwed on. Not gonna waste your time. Here we go. This is probably the easiest thing you'll ever do. Three steps. One, take the brakes off. Two, all right, easy, right here. And, yep, and the third step, right here, in the back. You got three bolts, one here, one here, or four, depending on your vehicle. So easy, try it, bet. Okay, DW40. Highly recommend it. All right. This here, you'll need a 32 mil socket. Most Toyotas and Hondas, Lexuses, 32 mil. And listen, WD-40, that stuff. I'm not playing. Mark it right here. You'll know why later. So what I do is I mark right over here just so I know you want to get this right. I know what I'm doing. I've done this before, but this has given me some issues, okay? All right, I've tried everything and doesn't want to come off. This is why you need WD-40, boys. You don't put that WD-40 on, you are go you're gonna have a hard time. Oh. Here we go, folks. Two down, trying to get this off. Oh, check this out. I'm at Menards now, need some more tools. This thing is nice, except breaker bar. How are you gonna put your breaker bar on this thing? Nah. I love Menards, because you can get everything for cheap. Okay, the 32 mil socket, 899.98. All right. Oh, check this out. I just saw this. What the hell's wrong with you, boy? You look like Mario. So, I'm gonna get the $24 one right there. We got the big boy here. You see, this thing is huge. Attempt number three. We busted these up. You may not have that problem, but I do because this thing overheated once. My brakes were so bad. And the brakes got really hot one time. You guys, I got it. Oh. Look the second it. step is taking the brakes off. As you can see, one. And right below there is two. Just take your brakes off and hang them up. I'll show you. Boom. So I got a hook like this. I basically just take him off. Take him off like so. I got a little hook and just hang him up. So we hang our brakes up like so. And now we can just take now this rotor should come right off. There we go. So step two. Most vehicles have these bearings like this, all right? You unscrew. You ain't gotta I'll, I'll pound them in and pound them out and have a special tool, squeeze them out. This is so easy. One, two, and three. Now, I'm telling you right now, WD-40 is your friend. Come on, baby, boom. Get it nice and thick, all right? Or you're just wasting your time. Easy job. So the great thing about Hondas and Toyotas is look, easy, right? Let's take this out. All right. So now we got it off. You're gonna have to pound here gently, break it and pull it out. Okay, pretty easy. Hey, so just a quick heads up. When you buy these online, let them know front, okay? Not the, because the back ones look the same. $40 online. 
O'Reilly's said $200 for both. So get these online if you can. Remember, let them know front. All right, because you'll get the back ones too. You, all right, so yeah, let's go. Really got to pound the hell out of it. I'm sorry. Beautiful, wonderful, I am amazing. Look at this thing. Yep, you son of a gun. So what you wanna do now, get some grease. Grease this area up and clean around here, all right? And put, put the bearing back on. Pretty basic, right? You ain't gotta do too much here. The sensor, you ain't gotta mess with it. I messed up hardcore here. Yeah, anybody see what I did, Ron? None of you? Come on, people. Right here. What I forgot was the backing. Damn it, now I gotta pound it out. No! I found the best way to line these up is right here. All right, take these guys out here. And as you can see right there, you line them up. The pressure, PSI, mm, about two bags of potatoes, about 10 pound pressure. Yeah. You wanna get it tight, but not really, really crazy tight. All right, the next thing. What's next? Anybody know what's next? This guy here. Now don't get it too tight, just get it on there nice. Now you need your brakes. Put your brakes back on. Make sure there's no grease on the rotor. You're gonna have problems with shaking, right? Put your brakes back on. Make sure this is tight, but not too tight. Make sure this moves, all right? Freely, okay? This has gotta be aligned close to where you marked it. See that little blue line? Y'all remember I marked it? Yes. Mm. Oh, that's a good boy. Good boy. Where are you going? 